And tonight we have continuing coverage about that Lindell plane crash that took place back in November. You may remember that just north of I-20. KTK has received the NTSB report about what happened and what led to the crash. According to the pilot, after leveling off at the plane's cruise altitude, he says the engine, his words here, shook real good then vibrated. His board told him he was having some engine trouble and the plane started to go down. That's when he said he saw the field, he deployed the parachute, and then once they landed and crashed, investigators say a belt was missing and an oil line next to it was damaged. Both the pilot and passenger from the state of Mississippi. The feds say this, the plane was headed from Gladewater from Terrell when it went down.